Lesson 15. Explanation. We have many body parts like head, torso, arms and legs. A part of body that is used for particular purpose is known as an organ. We use our ears for hearing, nose for breathing, legs for walking and jumping. We do work with the help of hands and we see the things by eyes. All these are called our essential organs as they are outside the body. The structure of the body. The chest, abdomen and back together make up the torso. The head is joined to the torso by neck, arms at the shoulder and legs at the hip joint. The body remains straight by the torso. The hand has three parts, upper arm, forearm and hand. The fingers are the part of the hand. The upper arm is joined to the lower arm at the elbow and the lower arm is joined at the wrist. Like that, there are three parts of the leg. The thigh and shank are joined at the knee. The shank and foot are joined at the ankle. Toes are part of the foot. The head is covered with hair. Below the forehead are two eyes with eyebrows and eyelashes. Ears, nose, mouth and chin are the parts of the head. Some of our body parts can bend so we are able to make movements. The neck bends forward, backward, also right and left. The arm can bend at shoulder, elbow and wrist. The leg can bend at hip joint, knee and ankle. We can bend torso at the waist. Our toes and fingers can also bend at joints. Because of these bending at joints, we can make movements easily. We can eat, drink, work, write, walk, play, run, etc. We use our mouth to speak and without opening the mouth by signs and gestures. Sometimes where we cannot use usual methods, we take the help of special devices. There are countless people in the world, but you must have noticed that though the parts of the body are same, no two persons are exactly alike, even the twin brothers or sisters.